Okay, let's stop. So we're into the final stage of the afternoon. Uh, thank you for your res resilience and uh, commitment to keep keeping on learning when it might be tempting to uh, the attractiveness of knots or sort of I've done enough for today. Um, at this juncture in the afternoon, it's worth saying to you that you know anybody feels can feel tired. It's very natural and it's a very common thing at this juncture. And if you keep going, and we've run this lots of times, at 5.30 and you go with this next piece, you will be very, very satisfied at 5.30. So I encourage you to sort of take a breath, realise there's another couple of hills, and actually you have got some reserve tank which you've forgotten about, and you can switch that on. And actually the process of the next couple of hours will be energising, I'm, I'm, I'm sure you'll find. Okay, so we're going to do a second exercise. This is going to be somewhat different. It is going to be turbocharged, and you will have the possibility of it be turbocharged because I'm confident that you will want to apply the learning and the reflection of the last couple of hours, and so what will happen will be different. And you'll be, doing, you'll be in different spaces. You won't be doing the same thing. And the nature of the... will be slightly different. So that's my invitation to join us on this next two hours. We're going to move into transition. You will be moving out of the conditions of your everyday lives and into the conditions of this new organisation. As part of this transition, you will be asked to give up certain items which you've brought with you. Again, this is not a challenge of your personal power. It is to create the learning conditions for this second exercise. So I ask you again, engage that good sportedness part of yourselves and go along with it. Um, you'll be learning your position as either a top, a middle, a bottom or a customer. Customers, you were exempt from putting money in this morning, but you're not exempt now, so can I have two pounds, please, very quickly to Martin? And again, if you don't have it, please just borrow from a neighbour. OK. Pippa is going to circulate with a deck, and you're going to find out, if you can do one deck and then the other, Pippa, it, it, uh, you're going to find out what role you're going to have. And this is a really important thing, because Martin said... Uh, you remember the difference between experience and learning was like we interrogate our experience and we notice something. So I really want you to notice what your reaction is instantly when you get your new role. There's a lot in that, as you'll see. Okay, so we'll start over here. Pippa, could you go with it, around with the deck for the bottoms? The people who were bottom this morning and just give them a new role. Martin, if you take the other deck. Okay, so if you just pop that on. And uh, notice your instant reaction. Okay. Now, those people who were customers, middles and tops this morning, you're going to get a new role. And uh, again, same question. Just notice your reaction privately. Now, what I'd like us to do is we're going to change spaces. So those people who've now got a T, I'd like you to come and sit in the top space. If you've got an M, this is the middle space. If you're now a B... Come and sit over there. If you're a customer, go and sit at the back. <laughs> Nobody should have the same role. Okay, that's good. That's great. Okay, so quick reactions. Those people who were tops this morning, who are now bottoms, could you just indicate where you are? Um, Okay, there's a smiling face here. I want to ask you, how are you feeling? Fine. Fine? Yeah? yeah. Have, a rest. Have a rest? Yeah, okay. <laughs> smiling, smiling, lighter faces. Those people who are bottoms this morning are now tops, how, how are you feeling? Anxious. You're, you're middle. <laughs> so, 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 the anticipation of being a top makes you feel anxious. <laughs> Just in the prospect of getting it, yeah. What about those who are actually tops? Uh, I'm expecting challenges and yeah. some, <laughs> some interest. In yeah. Yeah. yeah, bracing, bracing yourself. Bracing yeah, I can see that. <laughs> yep. Anything else? Any other reactions? Not enthusiastic. You're, you're what? I'm not enthusiastic. You're not enthusiastic. <laughs> All right. Okay, so just notice what has happened is the people are the same, their history, who they are. What's happened is we've just changed spaces. Those people who are tops entered the... Bottom space is sort of lightness of relief. Why? Why would that be? The, the sort of we can charge through door A. We can charge through door A. This is, 
This is why we stayed with this question of what is the attraction of door A. It's the relief of a bottom. I'm not responsible as much. Or maybe I'm not responsible at all. Over to you guys. And Great, I can be a <laughs> So, but there's also the p possibility of different choices and there's some sort of anticipation of the challenge. Can, can we do something different? Okay. So customers... You're the customers of this organization, as you're very familiar with in real life and in this organizational exercise. You're the possibility of this organization. Um, you're the potential customers. You're going to have your orientation now. So if you could collect all your belongings, coats and bags or whatever, and uh, go for your orientation with um, Martin. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and people know where the customer room is. It's along the corridor. So we'll see you in a little while. And you've got the door B... Great. Okay, so we're going to continue with the transition. We're not in the exercise yet, and in part of the transition, we need to create certain conditions, and one of the conditions is that bottoms don't wear shoes, so if you could give your shoes to, um, to uh, Pippa, that would be great. You can, if you want to be more generous, that's up to you. We're just requiring this, the shoes as a minimum. Pippa... Could we give the Pippa, could we give the organizational hero fund, the small money fund, to the tops? So this is your fund for you to use as you wish, and it's for organizational hero awards or it's up to you. And also supply of, of work slippers, which is part of your inventory. Okay. So if I could ask the bottoms. If you just bring your shoes and just drop them here, we'll look after them. And they'll be in the possession of the government. And they can be redeemed by the tops for the price of £4 a pair. For outstanding contribution. Could we all move to our workspaces? So tops to your top in-house table, middle to the middle table. And bottoms, you just leave your shoes here as you go, and then go find your table. They're numbered as, as this morning. 